video is brought to you by G2A.com for cheap games, MSP and PSN codes. And powered by Elgato Gaming. Hey guys, how's it going? Masterbucks here and welcome to another 2025 Premo video and today we're looking at one of the best up and coming players in the world of football right now and that man is Kingsley Comer. You heard me, Kingsley Comer. Not only is this man an exciting prospect in the world of football right now, but he's also just a staggering football story. He's 19 years of age, he's already played for PSG, Juventus and FC Bayern. And yet despite all that, he's only 69 rated with a potential of 79. It doesn't even crack into the 80s. I don't know how that computes, but anyway, fine. He doesn't have a great potential, or at least an 80 plus potential, but 79. I'm hoping that we'll be able to get much, much better than that, because this man surely will go on to be just that. He has tremendous pace, tremendous agility, ball control, dribbling. He's actually a striker in game. That's his main position, but he can play at left wing and right wing, and I'm pretty confident they would actually be better as a, as a winger than a striker, and you'll see that. We're about to go through his stats, and hopefully you can see what I mean. So let's take a look at the man's stats. 69 rated low. He's got 91 pace, acceleration, and sprint speed. The agility is 91 as well. Good balance. He's got okay stamina as well around the 70s. Everything else is okay. Some are not great, but that's fine. Still skill attributes. He's got good ball control and dribbling. His curve and his crossing are decent. He's got better crossing and curve, and you know, stats relevant to being a left winger than, say, a striker. He can play at both positions, as you can see. Medium attacking, uh, defensive, uh, medium attacking work rate. Three star weak foot and skill moves, 5 foot 10, speedster and the acrobat specialities, no trades, but I think you can tell what I mean. He can definitely play probably, he's got more stats suited to being a left winger, that's just my opinion. Just IMO bro, but anyway, moving on, let's get into the first season with Kingsley Coman and let's see how we go. Of course, as we begin to scroll down, we did, we did play him as a striker for this season, and in the first season, we didn't get an awful lot of growth, hell we got none. No technical attributes, no mental, no physical, nothing went up. I'm trying to see if anything's been indicated, or obviously nothing's being indicated, trying to see if I can spot something. Can't see it. There might be one or two, but either way, no overall growth in the first season, and the morale is very unhappy for a player that still played plenty of games. I was quite surprised by this. It doesn't happen all the time, but every now and again, you will get a high potential player that just does not grow. It does happen from time to time. We've experienced it all. Hopefully, that's not going to be the case with this. Oh boy, why did I say that? Why did I say that? Because now, now he's gone up by nothing in his first two seasons, and again, Form's still okay, still average, but the morale is still shit. And I don't know why, because he's definitely playing games. You can see, once more, no growth, to, no individual stats which have been increased. And I'm starting to get a little bit concerned. He does only have to get to 79 to fulfill that potential, but I am a little bit worried. I'm yet to have a player in this 2025 series just completely just shit themselves on me and just do not grow at all. And this could be the start. We might have it. I think we've got it. I think for the first time. Yeah, you can see his age is going up. He's getting older. This is the next season. This is the third season and no growth. And I'm still trying to see. Nothing's being indicated. In the first three seasons, I reckon for the first time, we have not had any growth of anything. Nothing being indicated. No overall increases. It's a disaster. These are, these are worse than Odegaard numbers. Kingsley Coman is letting me down big time. Thankfully, though, he's still got seven seasons that we're just going to skip right to the end of to see what he gets to. 79 is the rating. And geez, I hope he does it for his sake, because he's not won me over in the first three seasons. He has won us over in the first three seasons. So please... Kingsley, sort your shit out, and let's go all the way to 2025. So here we are, 2025. Has Kingsley Coman, in the last seven seasons, been able to sort his shit out and get to his potential? Has he hit 79, or are we about to get another Odegaard on our hands? Please, for the love of God, know what's his rating in 2025. He's only got to 76. 76 is plus, is three away from his actual in-game potential, but still shocking. 28 years of age and 76. I mean, I know we should definitely have a higher potential, but still, 76. If he had a higher set potential, he definitely would get to around 80, surely. But no, that's um, that's just the case, isn't it? Every now and again, you've got the player with the potential, but it just doesn't happen for you. Sometimes players just do not grow at the level that they should. Every now and again, it's I think it turns out Kingsley Coman is the one this time, so... Unfortunately, it didn't happen. It's the first time, really, apart from Odegaard, who's gone back-to-back, -back, that has really let us down. But still, Kingsley Coman, you actually look at his stats for his rating. They're actually still quite... They're actually not bad. His stats, like his physical attributes and his ball control and dribbling for the rating that he is, 76, are all quite good, as well as other stats that he has. For a 76-rated player, he isn't bad at all, definitely, and especially at, at the left wing. But unfortunately, that's just not what we wanted out of him. We wanted him to get to around that 80 rating, but it hasn't happened for us. Kingsley Coman, unfortunately, in 
2025. There you go. However, though, guys, I tell you and I urge you not to be discouraged by this. I definitely recommend that you at least give him a chance if you're up to it because I know I've had a bad time with him. He can definitely get higher than this, and especially if you play a training, that would really help his cause too. But anyway, that's it for this 2025 video. We'll have another one out tomorrow to hopefully redeem this situation. And until the next time, guys, my name is Master Bucks, and have a good one. Bye-bye.